somebody sick of being told what to do Sam Mashuno, it's your favorite nighttime DJ, Pixelated Twix, starting your Tuesday evening rush hour off with Alice Gray and her latest bop, Stolen Gold. And everything is golden here in the studio when we hear the dial tone. You should know exactly what to do by now, and if you don't, it's time to let those fingers do the walking, as they say. Whether you're a team iPhone or Android, we can all agree on one thing. This is the best part of the day, meeting our newest bachelor. Sitting with me, enjoying a cup of joe, no sugar, no cream, no judgments here, is Angel Pasada, a financial investor who is a native to our beautifully diverse city. Interesting enough, he did not sign up for a blind date on his own volition. Oh no, he was practically dragged here by one of our previous bachelors, Nico St. Clair. Word gets around, listeners, if you need a date, I'm your girl. But I digress. Mr. Posada is quite the ambitious one with the goals of retiring early with a very healthy bottom line. He says this is his best asset and also his worst because he is definitely a workaholic. Time spent in the office means more dinero in his pockets. He also states that he doesn't have much time for rest and relaxation. And he practically lives in his custom-made Armani suits. He certainly seems pretty uptight. Not sure how a night on the town would go with this one. Would your dinner date be dominated by a conversation about cash equivalents, net income, and the gross national debt? If asset allocation and expense ratio rings your Wall Street bell, then Angel might be a great investment for you. All puns intended. That being said, the lines are open and we will chat with Mr. Pasada after cassette tapes croons about none other than love. Baby, you could keep me going, cause you've been everywhere. Let me take up all the love you're showing. I need it more than ever. It's been a couple weeks since I've actually done a cast video and I've just really been busy with doing other videos, but I'm glad to be back uh, doing something uh, quite quick because, well, I'll get into that. Anyways, my name is Pixelated Twix if you didn't, didn't catch that earlier and I'm so happy that you're here. Uh, if you are new, welcome. And if you're an OG, you know what? Welcome back. Um, again, this is a very, very quick uh, cast video because you guys I was creating this sim and I stopped in the middle of the video and did not press record when I came back so therefore you you will only see this sim um, being created up until like the workout attire which is fine you don't necessarily need to see the attire i will make sure i have little uh screenies at the end so you can get the full gist of what's going on with mr pasada right um i do hope that you uh enjoyed that intro it was fairly long but i was trying to make up for the fact that well i'm a genius Yep. So just a little bit uh, more about Mr. Posada. Uh, he likes to wear black. You'll see that in his screenies. That is something that 
Um, he feels that it's comfortable because it's easy. He doesn't like to think a lot about his attire because he's a busy man and he has no time to figure out if a tie matches a shirt or this or that also he can go from day to formal very very easily um, this man is all about time and he constantly wears a watch if he could wear a watch at the pool he would and you will see him with a watch in just about every outfit um, that made sense um, he is certainly a numbers cruncher. He's also a perfectionist because he deals with finances. You kind of have to be. Um, he's a foodie as well. And that's kind of it kind of goes with the territory because um, he is a businessman, as I said before, and a lot of his uh, meal times are spent at restaurants. And he's gotten to know some of the best restaurants around San Maishino and the surrounding area. So uh, he enjoys a good dinner. So if you decide to date this particular Sim, just know that you'll have a great time uh, eating out with him. Now, the conversation, on the other hand, may not be your cup of tea unless you're really into numbers crunching. But if you're the right uh, person for him you would definitely be able to change up uh, the mood and lead him down another path because I don't know about you but I'm just not into investments and things like that I am more of the creative trait angel is also a bookworm which makes sense to go with his uh his profession because he will spend a lot of time reading mostly books about money investments things like that. But that would make for a great conversation as well, because if you like to read, um, you can share that in common. He loves to learn, so I don't think he would have any qualms about uh, sharing knowledge on the latest book. Whatever that book might be, I'm pretty sure that he wouldn't be into the romance novels. He just doesn't think on that way. He's very uh, logical, so it will be hard to romance the sim, and you could probably forget the romantic comedy at the movies. He might be into something more like sci-fi, which, hey, I like a good sci-fi movie myself, um, so that can still be romantic if you're into that. He's definitely a numbers geek, and if you can relate to him on that level, I think that you might have the one for you. Mind you, he is ambitious, so he would definitely want a, a partner that is willing to meet him at his level. And to be understanding that he may not have all the time in the world to spend with you. You would definitely be scheduling your quality time together and you'll have to synchronize swatches or uh, pencil him in on your calendar. Uh, so yeah, your schedule will have to work around his. So you'd have to keep an open mind dating him, but I think he might be worth it if he's your cup of tea. I don't know. Tell me what you think. Let me know in the comments below if he's the type of guy that you would date. All right, guys, that's all that I have for you today. I do thank you for spending time with me. But now before I leave, oh, yes, we're not done. Are you a member of the family? If not, what are you doing? I hope you consider subscribing. Hit that subscribe button at the bottom and that notification bell because I upload at least three times a week and you definitely want to stop by. Um, Minecraft, Boundless, The Sims, Dragon Age, all those wonderful games that I do play and more. Uh, you'll see that on my channel, so definitely come back. Anyways, guys, I will talk to you later. Until next time, ciao.